the excitement, people were lined up. It's jobs, jobs, jobs. After three years of waiting, shopping is back at the site of the old mall in Owings Mills with the opening Thursday of the new Costco store. We've been waiting for a while for something with the property to develop. I'm excited that it's here and I heard that they were going to put high-ended stores around here and I'm happy about the gas station also. Costco is the first to open at what's now being called Mill Station, and this store alone has created just under 300 jobs. It's about 270. That's about it. It's a good boost for the economy. We're going to get a lot of other stores around this area where the mall went down. Hopefully it'll help bring it back to life. So. Key thing is, is that when you put it together with everything that's happening in Owings Mills, you have Metro Station, you have Foundry Row, you really are talking about more than a thousand jobs. Uh, this alone in this area is $100 million investments. Mill Station will include more than 620,000 square feet of retail and restaurant space. Construction is already underway on Lowe's with more than two dozen planned businesses still to come. Quite a few other stores as well. There's, there's a Home Goods, there's a Burlington, uh, there's going to be restaurants. They just finished redoing the movie theater at $8 million, the AMC. Well, you see this big mud pit here? Rain, just like everywhere else, has caused some construction delays, so no word on when the other stores will open, but weather permitting, Lowe's should open in January. Here at the new mill station at Owings Mills, Jennifer Franciotti, WBAL-TV 11 News.